Hi, my Pisces. Welcome back, you guys. If you guys are new, make sure you guys please hit the like and subscribe button, okay? Um, Pisces, this is going to be for my Pisces Sun, Moon, or Rising. So, I just want to see what you guys could be expecting for your next 48 hours. Like, you know, what's going to be going on? What could, you know, possibly be coming towards you within these next 48 hours? So, with that being said, Pisces, let's just jump right into your reading, okay? So, while I was meditating on you guys' energy, Pisces, um... First of all, by the way, this is going to be for November the 10th to the 11th. So, this is going to be for Thursday to Friday. All right, Pisces? So, yeah. Anyways, I feel like somebody's refusing to release you. Okay? I feel like this this is somebody that got a little fame to their name. Okay? They could be in the public eye. They could be, you know, like very well known. And whoever this person is that's like kind of popular, it's like they're mad that you like a 10 out of 10 Pisces. They like mad that you that, you know, you that girl, like you that guy, like you just, you're just you Pisces. They mad. Okay. Whoever this is for some of you guys, this could be a friend. That's not really your friend. That's like kind of popular. They in the limelight. They got a little fame. This person is mad that you're like a 10 out of 10. They see you as perfect. Okay, and this is somebody that's like refusing to release you. All right, so let's just hop into your reading, Pisces. Let's see. Spirit guides, ancestors, universe, and the most have the highest lights. What's going on in this current energy for my Pisces at this time? What is going on for my Pisces for the next 48 hour reading spirit? This is going to be from November the 10th to the 11th. Let's see, Pisces. <clears throat> Okay, yeah, this is somebody that's, ooh, maybe this person wants you, Pisces, okay? Maybe this person had to make a decision between you and all these other options. Maybe this was, like, some type of player energy, okay? But um, I feel like this is somebody that wants to choose you now, okay? It's like they got all these little other options, all these little other people, but they're, like, very focused on you. They see you as a trending topic. Like I said, they see you as perfect, like... They're very focused on you, whoever this person, you know, is. That's in a limelight, their selves, okay? Yeah, this is somebody that wants to, like, you know, come in and marry you. This is somebody that wants to marry you guys. Oh, my God, this person feels like you belong to them, okay? They're very possessive over you, very clingy, too. They feel like you belong to them. <laughs> For some of you guys, this could be a Sagittarius, okay? Or maybe somebody who has... Sagittarius, highly aspected in their chart here, okay? Let's see. Wow. Yeah, this person is going to come in with communication towards you guys. All right, this person is definitely getting ready to reach out. This could be within a few days, but I do see fast communication coming in from this person. This is somebody that has deep feelings for you. This person could be in love with you. Like I said, this is somebody that wants to marry you or they see you as like, you know, marriage material here. Mm -hmm. what else please for my pisces yeah i feel like this person just mad right now because they see you as perfect they see you as that girl and they know that's the truth like you're just a 10 out of 10 pisces i don't know how else to put it this person mad you on your grind they could be mad you're pretty mad you're doing you mad you on your shit Ugh. Okay, this part this is somebody that wants you in their life forever. Like I said in the beginning, this is somebody that's refusing to release you. Okay? They're very possessive over you. They feel like you belong to them. Wow. <laughs> and I feel like they got other little options they're not even worried about. They're very focused on you. Okay? Let's see here. What else for my Pisces, please? What else for my Pisces? What else? Yeah, this is somebody that's, like, literally afraid of losing you, okay? This is somebody that's like, baby, please don't go. This person do not want to release you. They don't want you to exit their life, okay? Yeah, because it's like some of you guys are not, you know, granting this person access to you. You guys set boundaries with this person, and they do not want to let you go. For some of you guys, this person don't even have access to you anymore, they don't want to, this person is sad. Like, when I say they're sad, they're sad, okay? Maybe this was some type of player or something like that. 
but yeah for some of you guys this person could want to come in and you know take you on a date maybe this person is trying to come in as a new person okay but they're definitely watching you and want to um take you on a date all right definitely stalking your social medias especially your social medias they are stalking okay because they want a second chance to do right it's like this person's hoping for renewal here with you. But be careful because I am seeing a warning that this person can possibly have an STD or an STI. They could have caught something. So I need you to be very cautious when this person do come back around, Pisces. Okay? Let's see. Let's see, Pisces. What else for my Pisces spirit for the next 48? What's going on? Oh my God, Pisces, this person is a fiend for your love, okay? Some of you guys can have braces. This is Brace Face by Rod Wave that's playing right now. This person is a fiend for your love. They addicted to you. Oh my God, they could be like addicted to your energy in some type of way. This person forever wants you next to them. Oh Lord, Pisces, what y'all did to this person? Let's see. What else, Spirit Guys, ancestors from my Pisces? If this was a friend, this person's not really your friend. This person could be, you know, they want to be more than a friend or something like that. But for some of you guys, if your page is on private, I feel as if this person is still watching you. They're still watching you off of a fake page. Okay? I feel like this person just scared to tell you the truth here. Okay, so this person is watching you off of a fake page because they're scared to tell you the truth. Okay? Okay? I'm seeing not on your level, so this person could feel as if um, maybe they're not on your level. Or, you know, like I said, they match up to a 10 out of 10. They see you as perfect. So for some of you guys, this person's scared to tell you the truth that they feel like you're not on. No, they're not on your level. So this person could be talking smack, but wanting to be friends at the same time. Okay, maybe they could have said you're not on a level. But they talking smack, but still wanting to be friends at the same time, okay? So this could be a lover. This could be a friend as well. So just take it however it resonates. But yeah, somebody's definitely scared to tell you the truth. This could be somebody that live at a distance from you guys, okay? And this person is like moving real low key, okay? It's like this person's moving and plotting behind the scenes here. Let's see. This is somebody that's definitely addicted to you, though. <laughs> what else here, please? What else here for my Pisces? I feel like this person doesn't like rejection, you guys. So if some of you guys, you know, could have, like, rejected this person, I feel like they do not like that. Or maybe this person is afraid of getting rejected. This is somebody that, you know, do not like rejection. Maybe they have a fear of rejection here, okay? For some of you guys, this could have been somebody that got, you know, like fired from their job. Maybe this person got laid off or something like that. And now they feel like they're not on your level because they got fired. And I just feel like this person's definitely afraid of getting rejected. Okay. Maybe they're afraid of like you accepting the apology, but the access is still going to be denied because right here it says some of you guys are not granting this person access to you anymore it's like no more access at all you guys set some type of boundaries with this person so yeah or this already happened okay and this person doesn't like rejection you accepted their apology and you was like no but you don't have access to me anymore like that's dead that's done with okay for some of you guys you might bump into them while you're out like at the store at Walmart, at the gas station, anywhere. You might bump into them while you're out. So if you've been seeing like all of these angel numbers, for example, I'm just going to give you some that's here. We have 888-444-333. We have 555-222-1111-1010. If you've been seeing that, then this is like definitely a confirmation for some of you guys that you might bump into this person like while you're out here, okay? For some of you, maybe this is the person. Somebody got a secret child, all right? Maybe somebody was trying to hide a child. Maybe they didn't want you to know about a child that they had. They was trying to hide this child from you, okay? And they could be like, you know, walking away from a commitment that they could have had with somebody else. 
for some of you guys this is a, a fire sign could be um a capricorn as well but i feel like you guys are just maybe relaxing in the house you guys are just chilling and this person just very envious and jealous right now okay or maybe um this is somebody that they're walking away from that was very envious and jealous of them that's why they're just sitting in the house trying to relax trying to get their mind together okay so let's see what else here spirit for my pisces what else for my pisces next 48 please november the 10th to the 11th okay yeah so i feel like something's slow moving something's delayed from you like Mm, something's delayed and slow moving you like getting money when it comes to your finances your finances could be delayed right now it's slow moving for some of you guys i feel like this has to do with this person's energy they could be like heavy in your energy that's why something's delayed that's why your money is like slow moving right now okay because this person they keep replaying something over and over in their head that you said it's like something you said is stuck in this person's head like maybe they're like petty as fuck you could have told this person that they're like really petty in some type of way and you guys like took a step back from this person like yeah you guys walked away from this person or something you gave them the you gave them their space here all right you guys could have took a step back from this person because maybe this person like lied on you to keep somebody away from you as well okay let's see here what else for my pisces wow so this could either be a friend or you know Somebody that was like in the limelight that has feelings for you and stuff like that. I just want y'all to take the message however it resonates. Because there is a lot of scenarios here. Just put it however it fits for you. Okay, but this is somebody that wanted to cause conflict. I feel like this is somebody that wanted to stop something. Okay, like they, this person's literally about to explode right now. This is what this person's going through like. Oh my gosh, you guys. Could be a Capricorn, okay? This person's about to explode. She's big mad. So yeah, this could be somebody that's like they walking away from. And it's a she. Or this could be somebody that you could have walked away from. You're not granted access to anymore. This person's about to explode because they wanted to cause conflict. And it's a she, okay? This person is, like, dedicated to talking shit about you. They have no life. Like, this person, they love bringing you up. This person has mental health issues. Or this person could be talking shit about you, how you have mental health issues. They could be saying you fucked up in the head or something like that. Okay? Wow, Pisces. This is crazy. <laughs> what else here? Yeah, somebody got bad vibes. The vibes is just off with this person. For some of you guys, this person is definitely could be struggling financially as well, okay? Let me get y'all final messages, Pisces. Final messages from my Pisces, please, for their next 48. Final messages. Yeah, y'all the it, girl. Come on, y'all in queen status right now. Okay, somebody just mad that you, that girl, 10 out of 10, Pisces. They know that you're smarter than them. <laughs> okay, for some of you guys, this could be a female friend. Maybe you ghosted this person. Someone with ghost mode. Could be a fire sign for some of you guys. Or a masculine energy. Like, this person is really stressed out by your presence. They try to make you an outcast. Okay, could be a Leo. You might be receiving a message from this person within one or five days. They might be reaching out to invite you to a party or something like that. Trying to be one step ahead of you. It's like this person's trying to one-up you in a way, okay? It could be an air sign, but somebody was a burden. Somebody could have been still in line and playing mind games just to try to find out if you're, like, sleeping with anyone else or dealing with anyone else, okay? Could have been a water sign here or a Virgo, but it's like... You're not in communication with this person. You don't talk to this person at all. And they just want your attention really bad. So they're going to be reaching out in like three to six days the most. Okay. 
trying to come in with an apology they could be trying to come in with an apology off of a fake page like this is somebody that has a fake page okay you rejected this person or this person rejected you somebody got rejected but it's like this person could have like some type of screenshots or evidence or they're trying to get proof and facts of something here okay could be a scorpio maybe this person's not single maybe you guys block this person somebody is blocked okay and if they were sending you know negative energy towards you your return back to sender backfired on this person because they're clout chaser they want attention like they just want you to mention them to gain clout off of you and your success and whatever you got going on because either this person wants you back or somebody else wants you back but this person is like an impersonator like they not even acting like their damn selves here okay could be a jealous ex or just somebody that was a fling could be a sagittarius all right Maybe this was just like some type of old frenemy that was just still pressed over something that could have happened, you know, in the past. All right, Pisces. So I'm just going to leave it there. <laughs> um, let me get y'all advice real quick and then I'm going to close it out for sure. <sighs> Let's see, Pisces. All right. <laughs> What is my Pisces advice, please, for the next 48 hours, November the 10th to the 11th? Pisces advice, please. Pisces advice. Oh, okay. Let me just get one because I don't like the way that flew out. Let me just get one for Pisces, please, spirit. What's Pisces advice for the next 48? Pisces advice for my Pisces, please. All right, we still gonna get sued. <laughs> All right, so you guys are giving too many fucks, okay? Pisces, give zero fucks. Don't give these people, mm -mm, you guys are caring too much. Stop it. Don't give these people no type of attention. This person, whoever it is, you're giving too many fucks. Give zero is what they're saying. All right, and it's time to let go. Move the fuck on. So you guys need to move the fuck on or you guys already did because I'm seeing you guys are no longer granted access to whoever this is. Okay? Yeah, I'm seeing stop, stop texting, stop stalking, stop checking on that person. Just stop, okay? Spend your time on someone that's worth it. Do not waste it on ridiculousness. I can't even say that right. Ridiculousness. Y'all yeah, know what I'm trying to say. But yeah, don't force it, Pisces. All right, some of you guys need a big hug right now. And I'm sending you hugs, virtual hugs through the phone, okay? All right. So, Pisces, that's, that's your reading for your next 48 hours. Make sure you guys please like and subscribe to my channel if you guys are new once again. If you guys are interested in booking any personal readings with me, I suggest that you please check the description box below. Or if you have any questions for me, please text my number, okay, Pisces? And I'll see you guys later and enjoy your next 48 hours, all right?